now we will discuss about the importing the analytical velocity profile in the CFD post. And also we will compare the different velocity profiles from the different meshes. First we will compare the fine mesh with the analytic result and then we will also compare with the other meshes. So first thing first, as uh, we have already made the velocity profile and uh, it is inside the, the folder which uh, I have already shared with you with you so here you can see that the, we have the this uh, analytic velocity profile excel file okay so the only thing you you will do with uh, this file is to just put the another column and uh, initially this was like this which we plotted here then simply you have to uh, insert a new column and just put the one comma in the first cell and then just drag the corner of the this cell to put the commas in the all the other cells you can make it in the middle of the row also for other cells also in the middle Now from here we will copy the file and before that we will uh, plot the plot the velocity profile and uh, let me change the location of the line to the 0, 0 and 7 and 0 0.1 and 7. This is the line we have over here at the radial location at the z is equal to 7 meters now uh, i would plot the this uh, graph in the chart one and from here i will choose the x axis as the velocity w on the y axis this will be the y so i have the this velocity profile let let me call this one as a as the name as the fine mesh okay so we have the profile for the for the fine mesh from the cfd now our task is to is to import the analytical velocity profile in the CFD post and then compare it with the CFD results from the fine mesh. So what I will do is first I will create a file format for the for the CFD post so that I can import the analytical velocity profile which I have in the Excel format. So I will export this file and uh, let's let me call this one as the uh, last profile and it's the fine match okay so just open this file which is the velocity profile fine match with the help of the notepad or uh, any other software like a notepad you can use it okay then just change that that uh, line over here as a name so I will change the line this one as I will call this one as the analytical velocity profile and uh, I will delete these data 
and from the Excel I will copy this whole data, all three columns, including the comma column where I have put the comma, and paste this one over here, and file and save as. We call this one any any name you want, but this should be the some name which should be meaningful. Let's say classy profile, and uh, this is the classy profile. And I will call this one as a smell light Okay. Then I will go to the to the CFD post and uh, from the data series I will put the new data series here and I will put the name as the analytical and before that I will put the Excel last three okay and underscore is the analytical classic profile then I will click on the file and I will go to the directory and from here I will choose the velocity profile analytical dot csv this is very very necessary to put the csv format here the, the file extension should be the dot csv and click on the apply so you can see that the, we have the both the data they are sorted on the same graph you can change the uh, line display properties so let me make it uh, some different color and I will put the symbols like uh, triangle with a green color you can change if you want you can change the, the legend etc so let me format this one so I would put this one on the uh, left bottom and uh, I will be having the more width and the less height so I will put the point 3 and the point 2 here and if you want to change the, the size of the this, this text then you can change it to the let's say some value like a 12 then maybe again you need to change the width and, width and the height of this text so let me make it 0.412 uh, just 0.4 or maybe 0.35 this will be the enough for our case so go to file and you can save the picture let's say call this file as a and you can also change the directory if you want you can call this one as a velocity new file and uh, okay We should have some file here, velocity profile dot PNC. Double click the file, this will open the file in the image viewer. So this is the velocity profile for the uh, from the CFD and as well as from the analytical data. So this is how we we can plot the picture in the CFD. Sorry, how we can plot the uh, velocity profile or any any other data in the XI plot from the analytical results, and the same is also shown in the in this uh, PowerPoint slide. So this is the same thing we are discussing here. And next thing is advanced CFD options, which we will cover in the next lecture.